Aigo, Aigo, yeah. Sarah, yeah. thank you so much for today. It's been really fun hanging out. It's been good, hasn't it? We've been exploring the fancy overpass Four with row. the Australian accent, Sol Row. <laughs> In the London accent, is uh, Is that, is that London? Sol uh, Sol Row. Sol Row. Sol Row. It's Sol Row. I was genuinely surprised by the view up there. You know, there's so many tall skyscrapers yeah, yeah, around there, but you yeah. can actually like, we got some, we got some nice pictures from yeah. there. Got there, we played the game, right? You know that I like like escape rooms yeah. and like those kind of games. Yeah. I have the problem because we, we were playing the Korean one. Yeah. So that's like, that was, we struggled with that a bit. <laughs> but I think it's really cute that you were saying like, you know, normally you're kind of like anti-touristy stuff. Yeah, yeah, but I'm yeah. like, I like, I like the cute stuff. I, and like, we wouldn't have gone there otherwise. Yeah. Growing up in a city like London, it's like, mm. you phase that stuff out in the city that you live in. And like really? being in that solo today was just like, the feeling, the energy, and being there with you was, <laughs> I, I, I found that so fun. It kind of contextualizes a city a little bit nicer. Yeah, no, I get what you mean by yeah. that. Gives you kind of like it, because even like when we were pointing it out, I was like over there's like Myeongdong and here's yeah, that. That's and it. it's like, you don't realize how, close all yeah. of this is in Seoul because yeah. that's a different thing for me yeah. like in Brisbane like right. you've been to Brisbane yep. every there's not much in it and everything's very far away mm. in the past like you know the things that like I always missed about home was the yeah. greenery yeah. and it's so hard to get that into a city but then they kind of brought it up above 100% so I think there's three different games you can play yeah, yeah, so yeah. We, we just did the we did the, we we did did the, the romantic romance. one because hey a kind of romance ticks ticks um. <laughs> Everyone always thinks we're dating anyway, so yeah. it's like, let's just feed that room up. <laughs> Sarah's off is dead funning it. <laughs> we wrote love letters. We did. Or letters. We, we had tea. We had tea, which I liked. We wrote love letters. We wrote love letters. Um, we got and then the printed receipt. We got the printed receipt. I wanted the bingsu there though, but it's like... Oh yeah, they had bingsu, right? Yeah, it's cold today, but I really, I yeah. secretly really wanted that. Yeah, I dabble. dabble. I'll have a... Every dabble now and in the bingsu. Uh, every now and again. I like the shaved ice and stuff. I love like a, sp a spoonful of it. Yeah. How did it feel walking mm. through, you know, and playing that game? How did that feel? It was different because it was with you. Mm. Yeah, like if normally... It, if it was a real, actual someone you liked. I like you. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, Joe, <laughs> not again. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, you mean like like a date date? Yeah, no, if it was, yeah, like oh. someone, someone you liked, how, how do I you... I can't even imagine it's been so long since I've been on the, This is the closest I get to a <laughs> this date. Is, this is, yeah, this, is, this, is, this, is, this was a date for all intents and purposes. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah. right, right, right. No, I liked it. <laughs> it's, it's a Yonsip date. It's a Yonsip date, I yeah. like that. Yonsip date. And I think it was cool. Because it's like, you know what though, it would make it an actual really good date. Yeah. Because like, especially if you're getting to know somebody, yeah. then you know sometimes people can be like a bit awkward, so it gives you something to do. Like you were saying, you're yeah. going through this, you've got this specific place you've got to yeah, go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It takes you across the whole the journey. Thing. Highlight yeah. for me. Yeah, beatbox piano. Beatbox piano, serenading. Serenading Sarah? Serenading Sarah. Oh. There we go. Pretty sorry. It's a pretty sound. Oh Adam Taran, sorry. <gasps> oh my gosh. Yeah. They have these little kiwi berries. They have ones like this in Australia. Wow. Yeah. But they, um, I think the ones in Australia are a bit different, but they look like little mini kiwis. Do you eat them or do you, are they just like I for, think these are the... different to the ones in Australia because the ones in Australia are literally like a miniature kiwi. So they're wow. sweet. But this one, the skin looks a bit different. Should we try a bit? Will that just eat, or is it just there to give taste to the? I think it's just to give taste to the sauce. It was hard. Wow, this is different to the Australian ones. The Australian ones are literally like a bit like a berry. Wow! Oh my gosh! I spicy. have no idea what just happened. That not as beautiful. No, no. Should I eat it? It's fruity. Oh, I guess so. <laughs> oh, kiwi no mogo 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 derecho. Mogo style. No, no, no. <gasps> I've not oh, had a kamja John in too long. I could oh, eat like kamja lang yang kyo don hedo If you want, <laughs> would you like to get married on the on the 
Solo? Yeah. That wouldn't be a bad wedding location, though, would it? It would be the best. Oh, it's hot. <laughs> mm. But it's so good. Mm. Mm. Wow. This is inner peace to me. I love this. Because it's like a giant hash brown when you right. think about yes. it. Yes. Right? Yeah. But then, like instead of putting salt on it, yeah. they dip it in like the, the kind of soy sauce mix, which is that, mm. still that same salty element. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm so happy. Feels weird that we, sh we, should, we should have some kind of like beverage with this, you know. Makli! Makli, how many of you have? Yeah. Except I don't drink, so you can have my makli and I'll eat your pajon. <laughs> No. When I first saw Bakli Jam, mm. I was like, this is, mm. this is beautiful. It's so different to like, because you know, like I'm Australian, you're, uh, you're British, it's like nothing, nothing in our cultures like that. Wow. Yeah. wow. So there's like a like a painkiller in that or yeah. something like so you can like. So yes, to this spa, uh, a spa team to go Yeah, spa team. Oh, so we're getting diet, diet yeah. coke, right? Wow. I love this. It's beautiful. Dan. Dan. <laughs> Dan. It's good. I took actually. one sip and I couldn't stop drinking that. Wow. I don't like makori, but that's tasty. Oh, shiwane. Wow. Very refreshing as well. Mm. Mm. It's absolutely amazing that this restaurant is like right at the bottom of the, um, the walkway. I didn't, I didn't know this little corner was here. Right. How long have you been in, in Korea now for? I moved in April. Wow. I'm used to coming for like one month stints sure. and it seems to go very long because you're like kind of on holidays, yeah. kind of not. But now that I live here, I'm like, wow. Those different challenges with moving. Sure, sure. Yes, 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 yes. I've been very lucky. I have like a lot of friends who mm. have been able to help me with that. Mm -mm. What brought you to Korea originally? Like I, I was always coming back and forth. Like I think the last two years I'd been about six times or something. Right. And so I was like, I really should just take the jump. I was only here for four months on exchange and I regret not staying for mm. a whole year. Right. So I was like, no, like with YouTube and everything, I should just like take the leap and just like put everything into it, see if I can make it work. Mm. And at least that way, you know, if you fail, at least you've tried everything. Right, like, right, right, right. But the very, very first time, you, I think you know this, um, the very first time was because of K-pop. Because when I got into it, like, it was really hard to get access to it. Mm. So I like, I love the music. I like, love this one specific band. Yeah. I think because like at the time I didn't have anyone to talk to K-pop about, so I just uh, kind of like closet K-pop. Closet K-pop, but yeah, <laughs> <laughs> no, it was. And then like, and then now it's like so big, it's global, mm. which is amazing. When I actually came to Korea, yeah. I was like, oh, there's more to Korea than like K-pop and K-dramas. Yeah. And that's when I got really into the food and mm. like you know learning more about other parts of the culture. Sure. When I stayed with you um, in Australia, like some of that food that you cooked yeah. was like. <gasps> Oh, that makes me so happy. Some of the places you took me were like spot on. Oh, see, that's because of Korea though. I had right. no interest in food before Korea. Ah. And I came to Korea and I was like, oh my God, there's all these flavors. I didn't, I didn't know existed. Right, you right, know? right. And I got like really into it. And that's when I started cooking like savory food, which yeah. I'd never, yeah. never done before. And then I guess that's why like my YouTube channel like started. I don't think it would have been food if it wasn't for Korea. Right. Like who knows what wow. videos I would have made. Wow, that's, yeah. that's really crazy because like mm. the food you make is amazing and the, <laughs> the content you make is obviously amazing Aww. and to think that that wouldn't have happened had, had it not been for career is it's kind no. of like wow I mean I've spent a lot of my time and energy now with this relationship with career and right. had I had never done that it would be we, I guess the same we wouldn't have known each other no in, in the same capacity um, no, because we met because I commented on yeah. a video of uh, Josh's that you were in. Right. And you saw that, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and now look at It was this. because of that laugh that I commented. Oh my gosh. That was why. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing to have that relationship with the country mm -hmm. or a place. I mean, I've been to a lot of places and mm. I love everywhere mm. I go to. And maybe a little bit less so of Europe because you can go somewhere and it can be, okay, it's a different language, different culture, but it 
doesn't stretch you. Whereas Korea was like one of the first countries I visited and one of the first times I felt, wow. Oh. And so just even like this, like right now, like the, the Kanjajon and the Makali, it's the just makali. like, feels so Korean and it feels mm. so beautiful to be, you know, sharing that with people I like meet. Yeah, you meet like a lot of people that you wouldn't normally, you know, meet in those kind of situations. Yeah. Like I think it's really interesting how it brings mm. brings people together, like that kind of appreciation of somewhere that's not your home country. Sure, sure. Like I think that's the kind of thread that brings it all together. Korea is the thread to our relationship. Oh, oh. It is. Oh. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to work out if we, if we actually just actually did somehow go on a date. So let's call this like a, a bi-weekly thing. A bi -weekly so, so we've got each other. Yeah, cool. Okay, cheers That's true friendship. That. True, that. friendship. true friendship. <laughs> we got each other's back. Cheers. <laughs> I, I just spilled because I was laughing. We're literally like the same person, but... This is why I don't drink. I'm already spilling makuli and I've oh like had two sips so far. Wow. <laughs> Ooh. Ah, Mm. I have a lot of taste going on in my mouth right now. Mm. Whoa, look at that. Mm. <clears throat> wow, this is beautiful, man. This is really beautiful. This is amazing. Done. Done. It's <sighs> great. It's actually very good. I feel like it's really high alcohol though. Is 20, it not? Twenty percent. Is that high? Twenty. Yeah. Yeah. Because mm. you can feel 7%. it like it washes over you. Yeah. Or maybe it's seven seven point five. Sorry. Ooh. <clears throat> seven point five is still reasonably high though, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, twenty twenty would be ridiculous. Yeah. Twenty would be on the floor now, would we? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This is amazing. It doesn't it doesn't take a lot for me to be on the floor, <laughs> to be honest.